Welcome to the 2021 Best Base Spot Guide. If you want this quick and painless, here's the map with the spots, and thanks for watching. If you want some more details on why these are the best spots, then stay tuned. In-depth build guides for each spot will be released at a later date. Starting off with number 3, Deserter's Gutter. This is one of two entrances into this base, and if you think of this spot as a three-part cylinder, with the middle part being where you want the base to be, and the outer parts where you want to stack gates and drawbridges. This exact spot is where the main base should be. As you can see, it's more narrow and it doesn't have any holes in the roof in this part. Personally, I like to have a ceiling base with tons of trolls parked down here where I'm walking now. And this way naturally leads to the second entrance. My advice is to totally block off one of them and have a map room inside. Let's head over to best base spot number two. This spot is called the dam. This is a huge box shaped structure with only one entrance and my personal favorite. You get room for vaults, temple and map room inside. And with one guy defense repping from the inside, this base is unraidable. Building a box-shaped entrance structure, starting with a drawbridge going to this narrow crack, the attackers can't place enough bombs to blow it all away in one charge. Now, let's head over to spot number one. Welcome to Heliograph Heights, the best spot for building a safe base for both player, horse and avatar's attack. As you can see, this is one tall rock making it possible to build tens of rows with anti-climb. The height of this spot also shields against several of the god avatars available. As an extra bonus, this base spot is close to the green wall and has an unbuildable zone towards the buccaneers bay. This makes building trebuchet towers against your base very hard if you claim some land around your base. For this spot I got some awesome building tips which make this space spot close to unreadable as long as you have one player online. Be sure to watch that video when it comes out if you want to build that kicks ass. In terms of your clan's easy access, I suggest building a tall bridge up to your base with a horizontal elevator going across the last meters. If this seems too much work, just use two vertical ones and make sure to remove them when you are not online. I hope this was helpful, and be sure to use the comment sections if you need a hand. See you later.